une voix enivrante sur des lignes de guitare colorées, le tout remixé par un DJ. Belle ruche fait groover le Toy Boy Festival. Les trois londoniens essayent de lancer leur nouveau label et en même temps ils essayent de sortir un nouvel album. Rencontre tout de suite avec Catherine Deber, Ricky Fabulous et DJ Modeste. Details, you want lyrics and everything? No, nope. lips are sealed. You can't know anymore. No. Nope. <laughs> you'll have to. You'll have to wait to spring, summer. <laughs> Where there's a, there's a lot of things that are I don't know that are changing in you know in um, in our culture and and in London as well. So I think that's going to be reflected in the album. Um, there's a lot of changes with the recession and um, people are doing very different things. Um, I think it's a good time for artists because. Um, There's a lot to write about. We're planning to work with other people um, for the new album, but it's essentially always going to be turntable soul music, our kind of stuff, and, and just us three with guests. But there's always going to be turntable soul music. <laughs> We didn't think anyone would take us seriously if we didn't um, make up a, a record label for ourselves. Um, and that, it was a complete process. It was just really enjoyable to you know, make the songs, record the songs and find out about how all these things work and the test pressings. Um, yeah, we just followed him and you know, hand printed all of these, you know, silkscreen printed all the covers for these seven inch records. It was like you were working towards your, it yeah. was your own little cottage industry. It, and it was a lot of fun. It was something that you think, who does this stuff? It's, things we did. And it, it was, it's, it's another one which I think lots of people um, don't realise that the reason we had our own record label is because you kind of think, well, you've got to be on a record label. So you can just make up a record label and sign yourself. <laughs> and, um, and then you're on a record label. And so, but then when you get reviews, it obviously says like the first single, Reflection on Hippoflex. That's all it is, it's just the name and that's your company. One of us might have an idea about a riff or a loop or even just a drum beat or a drum sound and then we'll play it to the other person, the other person will say, we well, try doing this with it. And we all try and influence each part of the process. We kind of all work together, really. It's, that's when it's fun as well, because there are quite a lot of producers who will try and get a, write a song, or write, write a track, then try and get a vocalist to perform on it. And I think often those records sound more produced. They don't sound like songs, because they're not songs. They're, they're, they're a musical idea, which has something else over the top.
Et n'oubliez pas, restez connectés et sortez branchés Thank <laughs> you.